It's Friday, people! Yeah! It's Friday Fitness in full effect right here at AL. Hey guys, welcome back to Fitness Friday. So we are starting our Fitness Fridays again. Uh, those of you that don't know or that watched the channel before, I ended up having some postpartum depression and had to take a couple weeks and step back so I could get everything taken care of. But I am back. I am full blown in the middle of track season. And so I have lots of energy and excitement. So this week's challenge is going to be no eating out for the week. So for me with track, I am coaching from like 2.30 until 4.30 every day and then on track meet days, I am gone from anywhere between like one to seven or eight at night. And so food is kind of rough and I'm trying to make sure that I have food for my family but even if I do cook for them, sometimes I'm not home to eat it and I end up picking something up on the way home and it is not good for your body to eat out consistently. The food that you get when you eat out has a lot of preservatives in it. It's not the same as the things that you buy from the grocery store or that you plant in your garden. It has more preservatives in it so that it stays fresh longer so that they can keep it longer. It's also mass produced so it's not as healthy as you would like. They want to make it cheap so it's cheap for you to buy so they buy the old cows and chickens and that kind of stuff to make their product so that they can sell it to you for very inexpensive. But though it's okay to eat out some of the time, it's not something that we should be doing on a consistent basis. So to kind of jump start that process of not eating out so much, we are going to take one week and not eat out at all. This is gonna be a little bit hard for me because when I get home at night and I've been coaching high schoolers for a few hours, I'm exhausted and I'm tired and I don't wanna cook. So it's gonna take some planning. And I will put a link to my meal planning video up here in the corner that will kind of give you a step or an idea of how to meal plan for the week. I do it for the month but so that you can have those meals planned ahead of time so that you're eating wholesome food throughout the week instead of going to the store or running and getting pizza or anything like that. It's gonna save on our calories. Any of you that have had a burger, like you look at the burgers at McDonald's or Wendy's or wherever, and a burger is like 610 calories. That's a lot of calories. That's like half of a day's worth of calories in one burger. And usually you're not full with that burger. So you have fries and a drink and you don't realize how many calories you're getting. So we are going to not count calories, but we're gonna combat that by not eating out. I know you guys can do this. This is a fun challenge. <laughs> Remember, you're trying to be strong. You're trying to be healthy. We're working on our fitness. Thanks for watching and we'll see you again next time, guys. Bye.